who's not been able to find that much warmth in the right hand and with any sort of consistency. Can't think of once that she's really landed it solidly in the opening round. Well, she's too far out, isn't she? Yeah, there you go. Looks like she's marking her on the eyes already, I see. Echoes. She's fair skinned. Well, lovely right cross up, wasn't it? Yeah, there's, there's not a lot of the shots there, but the hey, but it's still scoring punches. Eh? Well, this underlines what you said earlier on about the whole Indian team having really worked out coaches and fighters together what it takes to impress yes. the judges. Yeah, and once again does. here, she's doing it. But has going to get some laps of movement as she's coming forward. She's, a, she's an easy target to find. She, she's right in front of you. So you have to go looking for her. She's there. You've got to make Bogaheim look for the target. That'll slow down those combinations. That'll make her think before she throws. And that'll give you a chance to get in close and wrap up your combinations. Theoretically. Been preparing for this. Eccles with the elite squad, the Welsh squad in Cardiff. I learned the sport over the years in Pontypool, the Pontypool Amateur Club. And she's been, I'm afraid to say, pretty much on the receiving end in this opening three minutes. There's no doubting who's going to get the judges not here. And Lavina Morgan causing that. And that's how the judges have got it. Indian cornerman, not too rapid at leaving the ring, but the action resumes. How can Eccles improve her performance? Head movement, that's what she is. She's head movement. Not come forward in straight lines as she is at the minute. We think that Colin Jones, the experienced man in the corner, will have told her pretty much that. There, well, the hand at the uh, I was there with a chance to turn and have a throw. Not so busy with the jab here, Bogan Hay. That's the lot of echoes just to get a little bit closer. Might be a window here if we get some success. Too far out, and Borgia Hayden didn't make a pay for it, but just skipped out of the way with ease. It's good work there from Borgia Hayden again, those long, straight shots. But Eccles hits with the right hand, that's good work. Doubling up on the left hand lead, getting herself into range. Good job, Borgia Hayden. Actually, she's all the combinations. Really clever and frustrating for the for the person who has to take the shots because they're not heavy shots. The shots you can fire back off, but she's not there to hit. Ooh. Oh, she's taking the points away for holding. Well, that's an important breakthrough for Eccles. A little bit harsh. Well, I thought so anyway. But Eccles now is right back in the contest. Yes, yeah, just had a three really good jabs there. Eccles on again. Oh, another one. It's funny, a little thing like that opens a window for confidence and you've got a good right hand there from Eccles. Well, this would be a tremendous win if she could actually build on this and move towards a victory to put her into the last four. Good round this now for Eccles. Oh, that's a solid jab from Eccles there. She felt that ball with him. It looks like a different box, it looks like a yeah, different yeah. fight. <laughs> Borgerheim psychologically taking the damage of that point deduction of Borgerheim. Well, the judges, only two have given it to Eccles. And so Borgerheim, three cards to two, I think. But there's, a, but there's a window there for Eccles that... Put a foot on the gas and really, really trying to take it 
take it over the script of the night if she's able. Bobby didn't go get back on that jab, that was working for her. She was in, the right hand was coming off it through the and Echoes couldn't get near her. Like that, their combinations. Judges cards. Ackles needs a big last round. But the Borger Hain just would not always 20 seconds to tie you up. Good job. Oh, sorry, down there from Ackles. And again, there, that left hand there from Ackles. Seconds ticking away, though. I said she was a police officer earlier on. I kind of undersold that a little bit. She's a deputy superintendent. Oh, wow. Dock your cat back. I think that's just one right slip there from, from Eccles. Making headway here. And it's all because Borga, you know, she, it's a great effort from Eccles. But, but the real reason is when she's getting told. Borga can't stop using the jump. She stopped throwing that left hand and she's allowed Eccles to get close so Eccles is taking at the minute full advantage of that. And she's showing when she gets in close that she's ever been physically the match of Borgahain and in fact might be the stronger. Good jab for Eccles. What Borgahain can do very well is tie you up for 10 seconds. Well, is she going to be having enough conscious landing there to take this last round? That's the big question because this is a huge effort being put in by Eccles. They both get that finger touch together. Look at Bogger here holding on there. Really, really needs to get a grip of that. Already been penalised for holding and she gets a, well she gets told there, she doesn't get the point deduction. But she's on thin ice. She's trying everything she can to eat up time and keep the aggressive Eccles at bay. That's a good right time for Eccles. Yeah, she's not going to head back in the ball I think that's Eccles have a good round, that feel. Well, it's going to go down to the judges' cards. It's all about how they've seen it. And both of the Eccles with the more committed to the attacks, those solid left hands, have to come for something for sure. Huge effort from Eccles. But I still feel that I, th I think Eccles did have to win the, win the round. And for me, then, that would probably, that, that should really give it the win the, for the fight. But Borgerheim, is she coming now? Must be close. A little delay. The checking and double checking. And still they agonize. Who's got it? This is difficult for the two fighters as they wait. It's being checked and checked again. Must be absolutely on a knife edge. And finally, the result comes through, and now it's going to be announced for the crowd. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a split decision. In favour of your winner, in the blue corner, representing Wales, Rosie Eccles. Eccles gets it, and I think deservedly so. It must have been very, very close. They checked, checked, and checked again, but Eccles it is who gets the verdict and moves into the last four for a fight against Northern Ireland's Aaron Nugent.